everyone. So navigating social distancing and new procedures at school is a big thing that's happening right now. Districts across the upstate are making adjustments to slow the spread of COVID-19. Let's get straight to 7 News' Christine Scarpelli. Mm -hmm. She's live in Clinton with more on this. Morning. Good morning, Christine. You got it. Absolutely. Yeah, I've been talking about just about everything this morning from distancing in the cafeteria and just how that's going to look to we went over to the classroom. Now we have a big announcement. We've been talking about it all morning. Teacher of the year, support staff of the year. No one better to announce these two huge awards in Lawrence District 56 than Dr. David O'Shields. We're so glad to have you this morning. Thank you. Okay, so what are you much. doing first? I'm going to do support staff of the year. Oh my gosh, listen up. Very okay, quickly, guys. we've got Lisa James from MS Bailey Child Development Center, Cindy McMahon from Clinton Elementary, Deborah Wright from Eastside Elementary, Kathy Jacobs from Joanna Woodson Elementary, Lori Addison from Clinton High, and the envelope Give is. me a wave. Give me a wave, guys. Wave, awesome. wave, wave. Okay, here's who we're and talking about. And the winner is Lisa James. Lisa! <laughs> this is Come great. on. Oh, dear. <laughs> Congratulations. All right, we're on a time, Scott, so we're going to act like we're in the Oscars oh, now. Yeah. Here we go. All okay. right, we've got our Teachers of the Year. Emily Marney, MS Bailey Child Development Center, Brian Lyda, Clinton Elementary, Shelby Britt, Eastside Elementary, Kim Workman, Joanna Woodson Elementary, Beatrice Ray, Clinton Middle School, Ryan Kaufman, Clinton High School. And, and the, the winner, winner is, is Ryan Kaufman. <laughs> Congratulations, sir. Congratulations. We're so proud of all of these. These all represent who we are, what we try to be, how we try to be. These are outstanding applicants. On, in, a, in a school year that's going to be different, we've got excellent people. Support staff, teachers of the year, we're so proud. Thank you so much. And I got to brag on you guys, and you have a chance to brag on them as well. But this summer, you've done nothing but prepare for this school year, right? What's uh, that this like? has been a very exhausting year, without question. And people like this are the only reasons that we can make any preparations at all. And then parents, do you want to just tell parents real quick, just assure them that the kids will be safe with these The kids, kids, folks, with people like this, you can't do any better than the people that we have right here representing all that, we're, that we have going on. Yes, it will be different. Yes, it will be learning for every one of us. Yeah. But it's going to be great. We're looking forward to the 2021 school year. Thank you so much, sir. There you go. Live TV, big announcements here in Lawrence District 56. Wait. And hey, congratulations, you guys. That is awesome. We'll send it back to you. Yeah, congratulations to all of them out yeah. there. And, and, mm -hmm. and Christine was telling us earlier, yeah. she was showing us on, on, on Channel 7 yeah. how um, they were social distancing and how the chairs mm -hmm. were all going to be, you know, six feet apart. It's, uh, it's a great thing that they're doing out oh, there. So yeah. we're going to check with you in about uh, another hour. All right, see what else you they've got, got in store. Thanks Sounds so much, good. Christine. All right, coming up on Carolina Morning, a new primetime newscast is coming to cable. We're going to be live with News Nation on WGN America with a preview. Very exciting stuff. But first, a look at your full forecast and your live drive traffic when Carolina Morning returns.